Hello and welcome back. Right. On my um one of my other let's plays I've gone on up on this. <laughs> I've gone for the Fen G T which actually would suit us down to the ground as well. With its having its extra four and a half tons, it's actually almost as big as a bread all, if a little bit more faffier. Yeah it is. There's no denying that now. I am on doing line up. Yes we are. Yeah. Still can't get used to the fact it does the back first. I suppose it's because it's attached to that. Yeah, I wanted to get this going because this is the job that is, yeah, it's taking the time. And then we're going to literally do the field edge on the um, the last field and get the mowers going on that. Two sets of mowers. Hopefully this will be done soon. It shouldn't take too much longer. I'm not. I don't know about everybody else, I'm not that keen on the precision farming window there. I think it's very annoying. Right, let's grab the retriever. Can I see it amongst that little lot? I can just. Right. Can't yeah, there's no good in doing it scanning its fields because that is that pseudo grass. I can't remember. Deco deco foliage is the terms that uh, JM Gaming used, and I'll go with that. He's the map maker. Terminology. Right, let's record the edge of the field. Yeah. Yeah, now this is. Uh, I reloaded my game yesterday, which means I've lost all courses. If you look at the courses, you will see there's absolutely nothing. No, not even the name of the map. So I'm going to have to recreate those. Yeah, that is a true. Has it remembered? It can't have done. Oh, I'd forgotten all those field edges. I'm going to have to do again. Yes, yeah, the course flow was the only thing I did back up. I totally forgot about it. Luckily for us, I will do that off camera because I've already done it. But this one we haven't done. Did we do that? We did do it, didn't we? Do you know something? I'm going to do this off camera and. Yeah. We know the liming's going on, I'm going to start the camera as soon as I've recorded this course edge, so I shall see you shortly. Right, done. Now, how are we doing on that field? Oh, what are you? you didn't get a... I didn't even get a message. Now, that is funny, that disproves my thing. Now, I thought, yeah, I'd cured this. Because it was a course play setting, but obviously not. No, it's... I did my stock chain manual right, we need to switch the all on. So that is, ah, so it is literally to the right of us. It's all, these are some weird, weird things. Yeah, it's quite a wasteful course. Yeah, I don't want those, but not. So, right, let's, I did think it was a long time, so I thought it's not going to last that long. Right, okay, so then we need to grab the mowers now. I think what we're going to do is we are going to literally... No, I, th you know, I think I'd sooner plod on and mow with this one and literally bail with the other one. So I'm quite happy with that. At least we're doing the two jobs and it's it's ploddy, I know, but yeah, we've... Obviously we've got a lot of work to do. With the, oh, we may swap tractors over because this is obviously, with me being so silly, not replacing the tractor and then running out of money, sort of, with all the things that we had to buy. Yeah, I've left myself in a bit of a. Now we've got to really pace ourselves through my stupidity. We've got two sets of mowers that we can only use one because, again, I've not got enough equipment. Right, let's use the brain. His, his brain's not brawl. Follow me, you know one of your favourite mods. Let's use it, shall we? Let's take these two up and you can actually use Bollamy for this, but the difference in speeds between the working speeds does cause a bit of an issue. Something you can do manually quite easily, but I wouldn't suggest it normally. I really wouldn't. No, it's best to just set the two going on their own distinct courses and let them trundle along at their own proper working speeds, in my personal opinion. Right. Follow me, or you are 
move slower. I shouldn't lose the... Yeah, so my job is to gather this little lot in. Actually, I'm not sure whether to do it off camera. It's, I mean, even I drew, drew the line. I, I, you know how many bales I've got, and it is one of those. I do agree with Mr. CDP on a lot of things, and I do I definitely concur on that fact. Now then, is this going to see the back? Let's drop the front off. This doesn't always see this. Let's do course play course and create job on this new field and open generator. See, why have you not detected this? Right, i put this at 9.9 because it's supposed to be 10 meter. I'll be a slight lenient on this. Yeah, I may gather all those bales in and just, I mean, we know it's going to be, I think I worked it out roughly some about 6 million or something like that, and that was a preliminary, not a definite, that was a guesstimate, but I do think it's not far off. So it's not like I'm, right, generate, and headlands, definitely headlands. Three? Yeah, well, there's not much chance of us bumping into an awful lot, if I'm honest. There's a trees at the bottom a little, but... Smashing. Let's see, we will save it. I know it's a bit pointless in a way, but right, so we want to create a new folder. And this is field 35. And in that, we save the course. Activate. I'm going to just put mower. Right. And uh, first. And no, 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 no. Don't you dare. Let's grab that. Auto first. Now we need to do that. We need to stop that and follow me. And grab that course. Thank you very much. Andy for your assistance. Now then, where is the start point for this? This is the truth. Right, mower. Let's load you. Clear, load, activate. It's amazing how they remember the previous courses. because it is a very I mean we've done enough watching me do bales really on this let's play and even in the last couple of episodes that I think people would appreciate a bit of a break from it even though I do like there's got there's got to be a certain element of trust I do try so hard to And I think there's got to be that element of trust. Yes, I, I could cheat, and so could every YouTuber. I, we all know this, but I hate it. I hate it with a passion cheated, and we know roughly what, I've, what I'm aiming for. So if I've got 10 million tons of... Well, unless my maths is that bad, of course. <laughs> there is that possibility. <laughs> Where I should say, well, my calculations were out by 3 million. But I don't think so, somehow. Right. I think that the Lima will have ran out and we just haven't had a message. I somehow do think that Betty is actually on the wrong field. Have you limed someone else's field? Oh my life! Let's please don't tell me cause please having a bad day in the office. Well I think while well, we've got this tractor, we're going to go and top up some bits. In fact, you know, while they're doing the long job, because Betty was a little unreliable, so I think we're going to just do this ourselves. Now, can we do that? Or oh, was that one of those patches that 
Yeah. Smash it. Let's get this done. Is this on auto? Oh, I don't think it is. Keeps on switching. I don't know whether it's the workers. It's ridiculous this is. The amount of times in a let's play that automatic... I've never, in FS19, I never had that problem. Not even once. This is FS22, supposedly a better game. Oh, seriously, I really do. I've been mean, saying that even my I sort of thought, well, it could be my game. Let's give Giants the benefit of the doubt. Let's... But no. It's nothing to do with that at all. It's basically, I mean, Precision Farming's had how many updates? Gordon Bennett. I know some of it's over equipment, but it's still... It fixes it for a piece of equipment and then breaks the rest of Precision Farming. No, calm down. Let's not go into giant smashing session. <laughs> it does annoy me though, it really does. I think it does us all, if I'm honest. Alright, let's do all. No, that's not what I wanted to do. I just want to turn the lines on a minute to see roughly where I am. In case we need to dart off and see. Ah, uh, somebody blocked. Or was that... Was that me switching that on? Right, okay, we'll have a quick look. Make sure the... No, it really was. It was that. So we are going to need to... Switch that off and trust that this worker can actually work and stay on a straight line. Right. Ah, of course, I did know about that tree. Let me just stop the failure for a minute. sort of mistake if I'm honest. So right, let's go and see how Betty is doing on Little House on the Prairie, which we need to Oh. Oh, perfect timing. I think we're done. Well Betty, you were better oh no we're not. No we're not. Right. I do think we might be close though. Yeah, I think we was up 166,000 before all the scanning and the liming and all the rest of it. So, yeah, I, I definitely agree that we need a team of these. We just need more tractors to actually use more than these. Yeah, I've got doubled up on all the tools, but not got enough tractors to support that yet. Still we'll get there. Yeah, it's... It's part of the challenge, to be honest. You can't expect, I mean, even with all that GM Gaming has given you, you've got the perfect setup straight away. You've got to work towards it, and that's what we've got to do, isn't it, really? So, yeah, that is the game. And if, if I was got the perfect setup, how boring would it be for you that I literally was there, and I've got everything I need straight away? What growth are you going to see in the farm if that's the way that we've done things? I think I'm talking sense for once, absolutely. Well, hopefully a little bit more than once, but yeah, I do think I have got a point. Right, so let's turn the lines on, I would say. Yeah. Ooh, no. Yeah, oh no, it's right, the lines are going that way. Smashing. Right. I'm sure we can find something to do, like nearest, and we don't want any. Let's go and see how the animals are doing. Let's pop and visit. Now then. How are you doing? Health 6%. You're still on the rise, aren't you? Of course it's still the same day. 
Yeah, right. Oh, we can't. I was going to say, let's go and collect some bales, but <laughs> we need a tractor. Do we need a tractor? Some Wally sold too many. Oh. 300 horsepower. Yeah, but I can buy 240 for 50,000. But I must admit, I do like to stick to the sales. 50 kph is quite a fast one as well. Do you know, no, if I was going to do it, I definitely would go the way. And the other thing is, we have got that option. I don't really want to do it, though, and that is to cash that in. The actual, because I would imagine, let's have a look. That's probably my last thing. But I'd like to do this and fight out of this without having to resort to something like that. But yeah, let's actually have a look what what equivalents we can have, though. We don't, I'm not ever going to really want to go into horses in the way that I have in the past, because I don't know that it's as lucrative. Yeah, actually, that's not bad. I wouldn't mind doing that and then sticking the uh, fence around it. But I think, if anything, I'd probably... Yeah, the horse pasture, that's nice. It is, actually. It's not quite as posh as the one you've got now. We would need a horse box though, so we're going to obviously... But we did, we did want one of those anyway. That's the point. How's the retriever? Let's just have a quick look at the retriever set. Which would be... I think it's in miscellaneous. I don't think there's anything like a horse. Let's have a look. It would be animal transport. Could it pull something like that though, the western? I like the better Max. Which can't carry horses. Can that take? No, it can't. We've only got horses that are only in the dedicated horses one. Yep, yeah, it is. So, 16,000 boats. We would be gaining quite a lot. We'd move that in and make a nice pasture for it to help us out of the situation we're in. I don't think that's a bad idea. And I don't really think I'm... Yeah, I don't think I'm actually cheating or anything. Oh, Betty... You're fired. No, you are absolutely fired. I have got to take over because you are just useless. Sorry. That's the second time better you've let me down. I don't know why you can't follow the lines. Even I can do that. Right, let's finish this off now. Enough of this silliness. And then we will do what we've just discussed. We shall buy the horse box. Get our horse into it, and we shall sell that and get that the pasture. The the dearer one, not the cheap one. I'd, I'd like it to look something like, but that way we can afford. I think a couple of my the HDZs. Again, that's not going to sort us out of the mess, but it will assist us because we are running out of tractors before any job is sorted. I mean, they can even be mowers. We could get two of those mowing. I, I like them as balers personally because they. With them being articulated, they're a bit juicy and their brakes are awful, but they are an absolute all-rounder. You've got to look at the entire package. I mean, I would love to go for the John Deere, but it's not nice to always go. Mind you, no, you've always got to have workhorses on anything. You've got to recognise. Shall we go for something different, though? I do like the Deutzers. Right. At least the next time we do this, it was only topping up. Yeah, it's not as not as nasty. This is the obviously it's had no lime for a long time, and we're to we're literally turning it from limeless to limes. The rest of this, we might well get away with a couple of these trailers. Just yeah, we may well. That is true. a bit of perspective even though I don't like this view because you look a little bit like an ant but yeah it is what it is yes I'm enjoying this I am it's because it is a challenge and I 
even though the second chance I had, I've obviously thought things through, I thought a lot better, but still not managed to do things uh, as perfectly as I'd like. I did make the mistake with the tractors and then obviously ran out of money once we'd sort of, I got carried away with setups and all the rest of it, and then, yeah, I should just about do this. Wow, still, such a heavy tractor. Don't get why that Joskin three-point box causes such a lot of issues for so many tractors, especially heavy ones. This one I would have thought should easily, mind you, is the smallest, isn't it? A lot of that weight. Well, it's 7.9 tons. And it's got more weight at the back than it has at the front. So to me, it's physics that's not quite right for that particular box. Yeah. And I know I'm not, I'm not having a go. I would imagine that's an absolute beast of a thing to get right. I'm just saying it isn't right. I'm not saying all oh, my life black sheet modding to get this fixed or anything like that. Because it might be the game of physics tractors. They're not perfect. The giants have done a cracking job of physics, but it's not perfect. Actually, that's. Yeah, let's just get rid of the 97 litres of oh, precision farming. There are times when. I, yeah. I really do like you not to work. I suppose we could actually scoot him up the field. And then we're ready. It should let me do that because we've been scanned it. And it is our field. So let's get rid of that 97 litres and then we can do what we like. Although, to be honest, yeah, we probably will be. Yeah, let's not wait. Mind you, I won't be wasting, will I? Actually, I'll be just liming it. There we go. And we will leave this over by here because we are going to need this for these two fields. These are the only two fields we can act. Oh no, we can do. Right, let's see how the mowers are doing. This is the one we want to swap, actually. If they're still going nicely. Yeah. Right, okay, let's go and swap. Now, yeah, that's right, I do. I, that's was thinking this through. I'm going to set that going on the ploughing on the bottom field. Yeah, we've got a box clever and it's September, so this month is all, all preparation for sowing next month. So we need to stop the axiom, the big axiom, which let the Orion take over the road quickly because the baler is yeah, fast behind. So let's get this right. Now then, this is a quick change. Can we do it in time? That is the question. How far how much time have we got? Can't see the dot yet. To load the course. Resistance, that's what you bought, isn't it? Right, smashing that's actually not as difficult as I thought. Now we have got one of the six meters. In time, I do think we need the giants, the massive 26 meters. This is the type of map where two of those would be an ideal solution. Yeah, if, if um, there was ever a call for such a monstrous tool, it would be this map. But we have our trusty nine meter, it's still good. I think two of those and it really would make a massive difference. I'm not sure if that's one of the implements that's stuck in the house. We should have a look. Right, so the front bucket. Did I? Am I? 
imagine in the plough? Have I not got a plough yet? No, I haven't. Well, in that case, I think that is a point. A bit sketchy, I haven't the thought everything. Right, in that case, we're going to send this and see how good the pathfinding is to get to the shop. And ooh, we do need some fuel. And we'll probably need some repair as well. Now, I think. I think we fixed that bump because we just went over that and I can't set that up. And I do know how that happens. I remember I actually placed two of these by mistake. So I would imagine it raised the ground and cost us an absolute fortune to ride that wrong. But yeah, it was my mistake. So Right, let's set this going. We are going to grab a plough, stick that on the front, and the horse box. Yeah, we're not, I'm not going to use store delivers except if it was due to a games mechanic issue. Yeah, where, which it has been so far. So, all my life. Set destination. See, can you... Huh? Or can you go on the road? What? You were on the road and the position is blocked. You were kidding me. Let's try a little bit lower down and hope that this, this is a... We've been down this road and it's not blocked. This is pathfinding. It is a new map. You can't expect miracles. I'm not. I am not having a go at it. This is a common thing on a lot of maps, so let's just try again. Let's see if there's anywhere on the... It could be also how far big this is. We could actually aim for that. Ah. Let's just have a look. Let's get out as well. That Sometimes they don't like that always you to be in their thing. We'll give it a minute because it is... Yeah, it's complicated. Ah. And have a look. There's, we have a, some sort of a Mexican standoff. Both of them have booked into a bail and are incapable of driving around a bail. Yes, this is this is our workforce. Unfortunately, yeah, this is what we have to work with. We can produce sublime lines with perfect measurements, but don't ask them to drive around a bail. Don't, definitely don't ask them to go around a tree. Seriously, they they hate trees. They are scared and senseless out of trees. They are, really. ourselves a job and we are looking at our tractor is a very fast tractor so we are going to simply do our Overton shop a way that we've only done one thing one time let's make sure those tractors are both on the line yes I've got some dots on the bottom of the map we've still got the flicker in unfortunately yeah so yes we've been this way luckily this is a fast tractor so yeah I'm not going to it's a long way though, it is a long way. Still, there's some very nice eye candy to feast your eyes on on the way, apart from the flickering, which is a Microsoft and Giants issue. Yeah, I don't know who to blame the most. Probably Microsoft. Yeah, 
working in computers and having an extensive knowledge of Microsoft. Yeah. Even their helps rock years later. I remember one incident at uh, Active Directory. Um, there's a reset you have to do with Active Directory when it goes wrong on a domain controller. I, I won't bore you with the technical details, but uh, you have to go to a third party who is, points out the fact that the, to this day, to Microsoft's own documentation is actually wrong. And they tell you the right way to do the same job. And you think, who's the expert here? Microsoft or this person who has worked with Microsoft for many years? And the answer is the person that has worked with Microsoft for many years. Yes. Microsoft couldn't even be bothered to change their own documentation. Yeah. And this is this is the world I work in. Computers. <laughs> and I am must admit I am a Windows, yeah, a, an administrator. I've worked with Win I mean I do do a little bit of Linux dabbling. And I have, yeah, quite extensively at times. I uh, dabbled quite a lot in Linux, Ubuntu mainly, but yeah, I've quite tried a, a few different um, Linux distros. Ooh, I pulling me in. Yeah, I'm not going to get involved in squabbles and drag people into our, oh, my life, look at that. Wow, didn't notice that before. That farmer needs to fill his hole in. Quite frankly, I don't think we'll ever have the time to do contracts on this map, even though I said we would, because I wasn't taking in the scope of this beast of a map. It is a beaut, it really is. Yeah, and I've got to scale up, I have. That's my fault for the tractor situation, really. Yeah, that's quite This is going to be very messy. So I'm going to have to get the horse box and the plow, take that back, grab the horse into that, sell that, put the thing down, and then we can afford the tractors. I may have to go against what I just said a few minutes ago, store deliveries, because I cannot take... Yeah, I can't send them. Now, if this was a traditional map, and I could send them, we could send them down the road to the farm, I would do that. But, yeah, you can see now. Pathfinding is at the minute from the shop to the farm. So I may have to resort to something, not because I wouldn't do it, but because of the time involved. As in, I don't think you want to see me dragging just those from the shop. Right. Okay then. So then, get yeah, back out of the shop. Class again. No. Yeah. Oh, of course. I did store deliveries. So you mean I've just run all the way up here? Yeah, well, we've got to do what's right. And yeah, we still need a plough. So it's not a waste of time. I, I would have I would have brought that with me. I suppose this is an opportunity to buy two ploughs, though. Because I don't think one is. Yeah, I think we'll go for two nine metres, if I'm honest, to begin with. They will stand us in good stead for a long time. Nine of the nineteen, yes. And I do like the reds. I do. No, it's not a mistake. That is my favourite colour. The colour that they come with. Right, one on the fronts. Oh, Andy, what are you doing? You look like you were 
I'm just yes, playing with the bales again. That's all he had to do, really. Those who think, oh, this is unrealistic, oh no, trust me, yeah, you go to these sort of places and, yeah, the roads can drop away to literally, yeah, Rhino Pass and things like that. I mean, yeah, not just the Peak District, Wales are some absolutely corkers where you can break your gearbox going on those hills. It's that severe. I don't know if they've changed it. I'm, as a kid, I went through, we were going to a railway station in Wales, um, one of the Steam ones. Oh. Okay, okay. Right. What are you blocked by? Oh, are you blocked by the very bale? No. Well, it probably is actually. being some weird and wonderful force in this universe that is does not obey normal physics. They have their own special set of rules. Okay. And are we still There's a fantastic bail pusher, but that wouldn't help us out with a tractor without a front three point hinge, hitch, hinge, a hinge. See, you can't even push things out of the way, they just sit there like some immobile force of nature. certainly worth doing this though, whether it's deco foliage or not, it's still grass, yeah, it still has real weight, so, yeah, we are not wasting it, definitely not, we're not just ploughing fields up, because this will, this will give us the growth to actually grow into the map, basically, is, is the way that I'm looking at it. Yeah, this is going to cost money, serious money, and that is not an awful lot better than silage for doing such a thing. And let's go and get our tractor. From right or back up there. Right, so let's get this party started. Let's get cracking. It's a beautiful map. Just look at the vista in the distance. It's gorgeous. Yeah, it's so the one thing that I find a little bit. The draw distance you've got to, to make any even a fantastic graphics card. My gaming laptop has a beast of a graphics card. It really does. But the draw distance, if you choose 4K, is your 
resolution so you can create content. It, you have got to play around with the draw distance to get that where you can see the semicircle in the distance that literally goes in front of me and the further distance where things I have chosen a high yeah the trees are high quality but it's that draw distance that you can see the line going out that's yeah the real thing really yeah quite before that it's yeah quite low quality but also does go with the fact that your eyes do do exactly that in the distance you don't see detail until you get to a certain point so it is using the very thing that our own eyes use really the draw distance so yeah Johnson job in my opinion of that. So there are an awful lot, I do realise this game is massive, the elements that the Giants have, but then that is what they have to play with. And they do seem to have broken an awful lot of things, an awful lot more in FS22, maybe the more, might be the more elements, but it's still not, it still does not inspire you with confidence with all of these fixes all of the time and some problems like the messaging system that is still broken I thought it was fixed but it isn't and it's not a course play setting like I initially thought yesterday it really is that the messaging system is very hit and miss yeah we, we sort of have to book I, I've learned to keep my eye on the tractors every few minutes because you don't get messages like you used to on FS19 it was you, you'd always got a message if your work was blocked or something had happened but on FS22 very rarely we've caught them more than anything let's have a quick look talking about that yeah yeah we're smashing 50 we can't get up to 50 these fields these roads are too now. Actually, the sawmill, is that the road to the sawmill? Because the sawmill actually is right next to our little house on the prairie field. So perhaps that's, no, that isn't the sawmill. I just, I think I've received that on the map tour. I said the sawmill, it's just a pile of logs. Yeah, the sawmill's right over by us. Now I know we're getting close to home. to go and grab the, the horse and sort that out. Yeah, we need more tractors. That is top priority. It really is. Now then, let's look at these over here. Let's go first. Now then, let's stick this in the right way around there. Stick, in fact, yeah, the back one is right. So we'll stick I think we're going to put a couple of sheds down this end actually for smaller implements, taller ones though. And again, we have run out of money so that will be something we need to do in the future. So more than that is actually that way. So we should do that. Can we sneak past it though? Horses. So we need to go and sort. This is a jigsaw puzzle that we have to sort and do in the right order or else the stack of cards all falls down. Yeah, we have sort, I suppose, in a way, we've placed quite a few productions, so we've sort of cashed in some of our more expensive items. Now, there is one thing I do need to change, which I meant to do before I started, and that is the vehicle volume is too loud on my recordings. With this being a new installation, I think it's this one. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Environment. Oh yeah it is, that needs to be right down. Volume master. Let's try 6060. Right, and I shall see him recorded. Yeah, it was overpowering yesterday. I did one recording session. I got the resolution right after one mishap on Greenland. Uh, you would have lost one session on that. And then I got it right later on with the graphics settings. Did we stick the right again? We're going to use game mechanic system. Yeah, we are. Because this is just us being. Right, let's reset our. Oh, yeah, we need to. Where is that? That's 
Oh, wow, that was lucky. I was lucky. The chances of finding that amongst that little forest of items was very reasonable. Very good. Right, let's go grab this. And make our horse hopeless for a little while. We shall stick it back down here, though. And, yeah. This is only going to help us. It's not going to literally alleviate the problem totally. Right, where do we go? Let's pause on that end. Let's do the horse box. Let's make this as realistic as possible. Although I'm not sure you would actually uh, yeah, drive backwards with their ramp down. So. Okay. Summer selects and to trailer, absolutely we do want to move in summer. Can you actually move summer out? As in, can you see summer in there? Right. It's, I mean, can you go for a ride with summer? That's what I mean. I'm not sure that you can. But I do indeed want to sell you. Yes. And now we want to place the animals, horses, and we want this one. Seven horses, and everything's at the front. Yeah, I want to do the. F it's a shame that we're going to have two fences, but I, uh, I suppose we could make that part of the thing and almost make it as if it's a roadway. <laughs> right. Smash it. Let's go and stick. Oh, all the food. Ah, this is true, but it is, it is what it is. Right, summer select, move to husbandry. Absolutely, yes. Right, let's feed and water. Oh, we need to water this one. Right, okay. Well, this time we are going to treat this with a bit more improvement. In a bigger style. Right, let's fill the water. In fact, no. Let's grab the uh, trailer. Let's go and get the retriever off the edge of the field. Yeah, Betty and Andy are both working very well now. At present. And a good way through the field. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, I know we've got to get on to sowing and all. Mind you, that's all tomorrow. So this is all field prep for tomorrow's. Got to get out of the habit of seeing tomorrow, next month's work. When you consider the size of the farm, though, it isn't really surprising that these sessions would be monstrous on the si for the scale of the farm, is it really, when you think about it? Oh, what on earth? I didn't sell the original trailer, did I? I say, I always thought that was a good trailer. That would have been a bad mistake. I don't know that this, mind you, I'm not trying to, yeah, just to see if I can actually move it. Not actually, not putting anything in it. Just that I try and be a bit helpful, but no, no. Actually, I think it's because I'm dragging on the, uh, yeah, it is. It's not that it couldn't manage an empty trailer, it's that it's dragging on that header. This has not got the horses to sort that out, so you know. Let's just go and grab the. Uh... Yeah, let's do this while we've got it, and then we'll go grab that and we'll feed it with oats and hay and all of its bits that we've already done once. Horse box for going horse riding. Now then, oh my. Why are you not? Now, I, I'm not being nasty with that. That 
was terrible. It was awful. It is, wow, that is quite a tight. Let's have a look, let's have a look at the husbandry now that we're back in with summer. What do we need? 3,000, so 5,000 and odd. Right, let's go grab the big trailer and let's get some food in. Again. better look at that sea of bales when we get a moment that I say I think I will do that off camera I will and I shall just do a shot uh, and a little bit of a, a two minute conversation with how yeah showing how much it was because yeah if I show all that I think everyone will give up the will to live because it is just such a monumental task even if you time lapse it that's still monstrous I don't think we're going to go around to the plow this time either Anything can this can put it past the uh, harvester. Let's try and come around it though. Let's try and be clever rather than heavy handed. We don't need an awful lot of this. silo so at least we've got the silo for storing it's not it's useful I'm glad we did that it's a fantastic little silo with quite a high capacity you can say in that so yeah if we overdo the food in the trailers we can at least stick it in the silo for storage yes can't wait till we can afford some pigs yeah, I'm, I'm waiting till we're well established because pigs, yeah, there are my memories of pigs in FS19 where they ate you out of the house at home. six of hay Today. Let's have a look. Ooh, that's as close as you can get it, really. Yeah, absolutely amazing. Right, should we leave this down here? I think so, because we've got the big one down at the farm, haven't we? Really? Right, let's get this cracking. It's not, yeah, we're not going to. The main task today was to finish that field. We shall set this going with the ploughing. Set the course up. Oh, that is a point. No, we can't. We cannot. We have all of the bales to move. I'll be doing that first. Yes. 
I will be doing this field though, the one, the animal field as I call it. And I should redo the course as well, field edge. Although, no, I don't need to. If I do the plough, yeah, that is true. I don't need to do that at all. I can just plough the edge and course play wheel. Detect the rest. Right. So, what? I'm very glad we did get that drop of the uh, RQ Sun, though. That was definitely very useful. Right, let's go and see how the bailer and the email are doing. I would say they're either snarled up and they haven't sold us, or they're nearly finished. Okay. Snarled up then. And the bailer is about to be right behind me, typically, you know, so it's on another road. So we have got time to rectify this matter. But you know, because this is close to the end of the session, there's no way I'm going to do loads and loads. Oh no, actually, that's a point. They're not going to get the lines right if I do it myself. That's the bad thing. Yeah. So I have sort of changed my thing. I would say 9.8 is more like it. There's a less than a metre. I would say 9.8 should be enough to totally get that right going forwards for the mowing. That's definitely leaving a bit in between each thing. But obviously, I'm not mowing this for this particular thing. This is all free grass. So. Which I don't mean it's free, but what I mean is it's, yeah, we're changing from grass. So. We could actually. No, we can't. So we just take that over to the, uh, to the yard, though, can't we? I love the fact we've got the brewing as well. Wow, trying to find anything is an absolute nightmare. Uh, I could have done with the bale pusher. Yeah, I couldn't have done it though. I would have got it. I, they didn't. Yeah, the two ploughs are more important. Right, so we're going to be starting the animal field first. That's important. You can't set court display on that. Although I can't see the field. Yeah, I've got a need, need to say, and I just suppose in some ways it probably makes more sense to know we'll do this manually. Right, we're next, yeah, I'll do that off camera as I say. Let's just go and see France, who should be working on the last thing, and let's choose an invisible transport lines to go and snarl a bail up. Gonna have a quick look at Betty and see how many. Mind oh, you know, we can always look at the sessions, can't we? Because this is, yeah. Let's have a look at the totals. I know it's not accurate, accurate. While I'm chatting to you, we shall see how many we've done in total. 732 bales. Not in th the other thing I realised was I said about um, how much we'd got in the production. Remember, we bought 382 tons from the previous incarnation of the farm, so that's not quite right. Yeah, it would be 800 and odd tons. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> you know, a mere 800 tons. Yeah, it's. Oh no, sorry, I was forgetting. We split it, so no. It's still, yeah, we would still field one of those um, completely so. That is amazing. And this, as small as it is, you know, can still cope with those ploughs. So, I'm trying to think what we could set these to. In fact, actually, if anything's probably good for a plough, it would be the big blue one. It would be the big blue. I like that's a nice nickname. Big blue. Wow, this is silly. This is silly as well. Look at the hill on that. Wow. Yeah, this is definitely a side-to-side -side jobby. Not an up and a downy. Yeah, we're going to have to use the contour of this field very well. Well, 
better stalk. She can't figure out how to get around a bay or my life. Right, two more rows. In that case, let's take that up and we should get. First job, I would say sewing. So oh no, it's August, it's field prep. Yeah, it would be. I would scan the field edge whilst that's doing it, but it's literally, yeah, I'd be hard pressed to do one of these field edges in that time. And again, because I've already done it, it's something I will do off camera because we have already done it. Yeah, I don't want to be taking up any airtime for a job that's already been done through a black. Like, a, a glitch of my doing. We've already seen that field edge be created. So I shall. Yeah. I'll we'll look at the uh, way the course play works actually to see if there is a. I think I've already got the set modes here somewhere. No, I took it back, didn't I? ceremoniously dumped a habit of mine. It's a slightly, yeah, well, they've done some work. I'm not surprised they've got some. Right, we're just going to go and watch Elizabeth do the last line, and I think I would definitely say this is a uh, good session. How many have we done in the session? I was looking at the total, 132, wow, so this field so far 132, so I should say about 134, 5 maximum, which is amazing. I do remember I uh, on No Man's Land on FS22 when I thought 100 bales was a lot, truly, I, I'm not kidding now, I seriously used to doing grass, grass work a lot and I would often do little fields to begin with and start from scratch where you'd sometimes grab six bales uh, and they weren't six and a half tons either they were the old was it three and a half tons? no four, four tons weren't they I think the old bales in FS19 is that right? was it four? Oh, you, you, yeah I, I lose track it's amazing now it used to know that off my heart and you forget we'll just do that little tiny bit of clean up as well Yeah, so we've got some honey producing bees down here as well. And that was the honey spawn point, the little yellow box that I saw in the episode where we going out for the horse ride. Yeah, let's see if we can see any grass on any turns. If not, I'm not worried because on this let's play, I think seriously we will soon manage to grab another bale. Yeah, I've, I've certainly thought long term, three balers. Seriously thought long term of that. Mind you, they were very reasonable, 12,000 each, so they weren't extra, really expensive ones. Yeah, definitely not quite got my lines, the, the amount right for that. as I've just said are bigger now so and the Hestons yeah I've got the Heston Baylor on um, Westridge Hills yeah I cashed in the old ones didn't get obviously very good value but that's not really the point sometimes you've just got to go for it I did say that in the session you just sometimes if you fancy something 
if you can afford it, go for it. it. It's yeah, you can't always do the right thing. You can't always be totally practical. Sometimes you have got to try things out, even if it's a mistake. Sometimes because yeah, it, that's that c'est la vie. It truly is. Right. Anyway, it has been a monster session. I thank you very much that you are continuing on this journey with me, and I hope you are going to stick on this journey with me because I have a feeling that we are going to go a long way when we bought. Can we afford... To, I think we're going to afford one tractor. We are going to grab the HTZ. One of. I don't think we can afford two. We need to keep some money in reserve. I'd like to buy the John Deere. That's going to seriously leave us so low on reserve so that it's bad. Oh, of course, I've loaded the Kubota pack. Right, so there is a story to tell another time about that. Yeah. Shall we go? Yeah, we shall. This is the perfect bailing machine, in my opinion. And we're going to go for the bigger engine, because it costs us absolutely no extra. And I like the number plate. We'll stick with that. Oh, I thought I'd reset that. Oh, wow. It cost us 1,281, so do you know? There, it's reset now. Where did we stick? Where did that go? Is that down at the yard? It was. Oh well. Right, okay, and that is where we're going to leave it then. Yeah. Well, I suppose it saved me the long. Yeah, we'd say we're still roughly about where we were, but there's no way I could afford to without that taking us, plunging us so low. I know we're going to have a lot of money come through these, but that's not going to filter down for a few months. So, yeah, we need to get some silage. In fact, how much actual silage have we got? starting to feed our BGA 22 tons and 22 tons so 44 tons so actually next session it wouldn't be a bad thing to go and grab that and stick that 44 tons in the BGA to start our energy business going yeah we've got to start a thing you can't always do things at the optimal you've got to sometimes do things in the way that you can at present yeah and on that note I am going to say goodbye for now